Well, bless the Lord. Drive by a preacher here on our faith farm where we are growing and harvesting great faith. And I just wanted to quickly answer the question, how to become a Christian? And simply, at its very boiled down uh, foundational point, is that you're a follower of Jesus Christ. That's it. You acknowledge that Jesus Christ was the Son of God, died, rose on the third day. Died on the cross, rose on the third day. And from there, you can get into very many different uh, theological uh, discourses and, and di different denominational standards, man's laws and all this other stuff. But Jesus did not have that. We got to follow his example. And Jesus, all he did was, according to the scriptures, is that he called his disciples. He called Peter, the fish, he was fishing. He said, Peter, follow me. And the Bible says at once they left, he left his nets, they left their nets. So they left their livelihood. Matthew, a tax collector, he said, follow me. Again, he at once immediately left his post and went to follow Christ be to begin life on Jesus' terms. That's key, to live life on Jesus' terms. The disciples were first called Christians in the uh, book of Acts. I believe it's uh, chapter 11, verse 26. They were first called Christians, which literally means in the original Greek text, literally means little Christ. They were first called Christians in, in Antioch, Acts 11, 26. And so we got to follow the lifestyle that Jesus modeled. And that's it. All the other uh, uh, s topics and all the other stuff is is for theologians to, to argue. All we got to do is follow Christ. So what did he do? He loved. He forgave. He was patient. He encouraged. He teached. He didn't argue. He didn't fight. He didn't murmur. He didn't backbite. He didn't gossip. He gave glory to the Father. He said that no one comes to the Father except through me. So you, if you have any illusions and, and grand illusions of going, making it to heaven without knowing Christ, you're, you are mistaken according to Scripture. According to what Jesus himself said, he said he is the way, the truth, and the life, and no one comes to the Father except through him, except through Christ. And so the book of Romans says that if you believe in your heart and confess with your mouth you shall be saved and so it's very easy say Lord I, I, I acknowledge that I'm a sinner I acknowledge that I'm, I, I mess things up but I want to give my life to you I acknowledge that you are the son of God God became flesh God incarnate come into my heart I believe I confess and now Lord I, I follow you and then from there, uh, child of God, from there, friend, you just get into your Bible. Read your Bible daily, not just on Sunday. Read your Bible. And I, I'm and I know we can get it on our phones, and, and technology is great, but I encourage you to get yourself a, an actual Bible, one that you can highlight, one that you can put notes in the margins. And then, and then just begin to read and, and, and say, Lord, I, I, I'm not going to understand this, but, but I ask that, that your Holy Spirit would teach me, lead me, let it make sense to me. And then you find someone that uh, you know has a relationship with Christ. You know that, that they have uh, that intimate walk with the Father. And you just get connected to them, with them. Get connected with them. Say, look, I, 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 you know, you inspire me. You, you, I know that you have, you've been walking with the Lord for, for some time. I, I, that's what I want. And so I'm, I want to get connected to you. Here's my phone number. Or here's, you know, however you want to get connected. And, 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 then, and then you, just, you, you, you build that relationship with Heavenly Father daily. Daily. It's a disciplined walk. It's a narrow road, but it's a beautiful walk. It's not going to be easy. It's not going to be easy. But, but, it's, but it's, it's a worth it. It's a blessed life. Anyway, how to be a Christian? Follow Christ wholeheartedly. Not half, not half stepping, but wholeheartedly. Live life on His terms according to Scripture. Thank you. God bless you. And as always, fire fall.